I don't, I don't know if any of you guys have seen this trend going around on TikTok called the soft guy era. Basically, it's men standing up to women and saying, no more. I will no longer bring all of these things to the table and you don't bring anything to the table. And I gotta say, guys, I love it. I love what you're doing. And I support it 100%. Most relationships, the man brings all of it to the table. Hey there, besties. We are back to it. More drizzle, drizzle, soft eye air, all that good stuff because it is the gift that keeps on giving. So I'm going to keep on giving it to y'all. Don't even worry about going over there on Tickety Talk. And I know a lot of y'all ain't even on there because I find it and I'll bring it for you. So make sure you go ahead, like this daggone video, subscribe to this daggone channel, and comment. Let's get into it. Women's world and men are just living in it. Why are they playing Cheetah Girls at the bar? Cheetah Girls. When I showed up to this bar. Why was the bartender singing I'm a Slave for You by Britney Spears? Didn't know that I was listening. I heard I'm a Slave. I was like, oh, get it, Roger. And Shakira started playing. Why were the guys at the bar singing to Shakira? Like I said, it's a women's world and men are just living in it. Ladies. Talking about. You guys are already living this soft guy era. What do you guys want? What do you guys want from women? I want to know because it's like you guys want more. More. You guys do. What do I want? Like, what do we want? I want somebody when they finna come talk to me, they should know that they should come bring me a pair of retro Jordans. I want someone who should know <laughs> they should be paying 100% of the bill. Like, what are you talking about? Why are you even dating if you're not ready to pay 100%? It don't even make sense. Go, go get your broke ass in the field. <laughs> Anywho. Like, let me tell you this one story. This girl <clears throat> wanted to talk to me, so she said, you know, let me buy you lunch. I said, okay, go ahead. She said she's going to send me money. I'm like, all right, give her my cash app. She sent me the money, and I'm expecting to go look at my cash app. You know, it seemed like maybe a good honey ball. But I go to my cash app, and I see $30. $30? 30 What am I going to do with $30? Like, I spend more than $30 on myself on a regular. <clears throat> my, my meals probably come up to, like, maybe 200 and she's sending me $30. What $30 I'm gonna do? Oh, I eat gourmet shit. I eat five course meals and shit. <laughs> $30 not even gonna fill up my gas tank. 30 bucks. Hey, I think that, yeah, we're living a soft guy life. Like, I can't even rest in my masculinity. 30 bucks? <laughs> After careful deliberation, I have decided that I officially, too, will join the soft guy era. You don't get all this handsome dark chocolate for free anymore. <laughs> I'm handsome, uh, I'm educated, I'm tall, I'm athletic. You don't get all this for free anymore. Unless you're going to pay my bills, buy me a car, take me out to eat, and buy me gifts on the regular, don't even breathe in my direction. I am done tolerating the bare minimum. You can either treat me like a king, or you can get out of here. After careful deliberation, I have decided that I officially, too, will... Clearly what this man is saying, he said, you're not going to take all this pleasure without giving something back in return he said you're gonna have to earn all this dark daggone chocolate okay child this is so funny this is crazy shout out to this man in this video i've been telling y'all stop giving up the grade a y'all don't want to listen y'all don't want to listen i know daggone well y'all don't listen to me and you going out giving the grade a instead of giving the great damn f and then these biatches out here acting crazy to me lying on the internet i just had to cut my girl off because I just moved her into my place, and then she's telling me she wants to go 50-50. You were broke. I moved you into my place, and you're asking me to go 50-50. I don't tolerate disrespect. I don't pay bills. I'm in my soft guy era. What do you not understand? At this point, I think this bitch hates me. Oh, no, and there's more. Because she said, oh, let's have a little night out. Like, I want to treat my man, my man, my man. I said, okay, <laughs> calm down. I'm in my soft guy era, right? This girl took me to Olive Garden. Bitch, who are you? Oh. Because you're not my girl. How dare she? Olive Garden? What is Olive Garden? Down, down, down. <laughs> I literally, you know what I did? I left, I caught an Uber, and I went back home because I am not tolerating disrespect. Because what it looks like to me, it's giving fucking broke. You have no fucking money. My last girl took me to STK. 
And you're out here trying to take me to Olive Garden. Bitch, go to hell. I just had to... It's funny to see men talking about soft boy area, whatever. We don't want to provide anymore. We don't want to pay the bills anymore. Finally, because I always wanted that type of control. I always wanted that control. And trust me, if that happens, I'm going to come with requirements. If I'm going to pay all the bills, you must not cheat. Like, you must stay faithful because one, even one flirty, one text message, you're getting kicked out. You're going to become homeless. You're going back to your mother house. Yes, that's it. You must do every single thing I say, every single ass stuff I say. Every work, every type of labor in the house is going to be fall on you. And don't, don't even say no because you're going to get kicked out and you ain't paying no bills. The house is mine. So, girls, y'all shouldn't complain because this is amazing because we now have the control. We can choose what man we want, when they stay, when they leave, when they go, what they do. They I am in my soft guy era. Why are you giving me $20 to get lunch? What am I going to do with $20? If you're not sending me $150, ask my girl. Damn. If you're not sending me $150 <laughs> for my food, what purpose do you serve Ooh. i am in my soft guy era i'm talking to this girl she said hey do you want to stop over at mcdonald's bitch do you hate me you should have said chick-fil-a and at that that is still disrespecting me mm. i only do ruth chris del frisco's and nobu you should mm. know that mm. me and my guys are out at dinner for my birthday and i invite you as my girl why aren't you picking Paying for up the everyone bill for all of my friends <laughs> I am in my soft guy era. I'm talking to my girl. She sent me $40 oh, for a haircut. I sent it right back. <laughs> what the fuck am I going to do with $40? Why aren't you sending me 150 minimum? That's why I don't have a haircut. I'm not going to tolerate that disrespect. I'm in my soft guy era. A lot of y'all dudes need to stop trying to play it off and just admit it. Like, a lot of y'all dudes really do want a man. Because I be seeing, like, dudes getting online talk about how they in they soft boy era. <laughs> and they want to be taken care of. And they want dates. And they want flowers. Like, why as a man do you want somebody to spoil you? Like, as a man, it should make you feel good to provide. To do for your woman. Like... What 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 do y'all be doing out here? Like y'all really be crying because y'all don't get the same stuff that women get. Like y'all not women. Y'all are men. <laughs> like what is y'all doing? Y'all just be too sassy. Like y'all be wanting to <laughs> y'all be getting clear coats on your on your nails, clear coats on your toes. Like what is y'all doing? I remember I took this like I don't care like I spend money on anybody, even my friends. And I remember like I had took this dude to get some sushi, and I was just thinking about it. Like, he's really a bad bitch. Like, he went shopping with me, and then I bought him some sushi. Like, <laughs> a lot of y'all really want to be bad bitches. Like, y'all really want to be baddies. Like, <laughs> what is wrong with y'all? Like, y'all be getting mad because y'all can't be women. Like, what what is wrong with y'all? Like, who raised y'all? Stop it. Get some help. Like, y'all really be getting online to talk about... And and it's not fair that like girl when has when has y'all don't want us to be equal to y'all in no other way like why is y'all acting sassy like what is wrong with y'all like y'all is uh like y'all want a man just admit it if you want to be wine and dine and you want flowers you want a fucking man just admit it. <laughs> watch next next y'all gonna be crying because y'all can't be bottle boys y'all gonna start trying Y'all gonna start trying to be bottle boys. Y'all gonna come out with a speedo trying to dance and shit so y'all can get some money too because y'all gonna complain. Because y'all don't... Y'all funny, man. Y'all be wearing a man, man. This generation is a mess. Like... And this is exhibit A as to this generation and it being a mess. This right here, this person right here on the screen is a mess. She's the most illiterate person I've heard on the daggone internet this daggone week. The all damn dacity to get up here and talk about somebody else while sounding like this. It's always sassy, ABCD, LGBT, as far as men are concerned, not recognizing what it is that they're doing as usual, same old thing. See, these are the people that y'all need to leave alone. Anybody who's dealing with this person is of the same caliber, so they all can go ahead and continue to deal with each other, of course. She over here talking all the sugar on the XT, but I promise you, she ain't happy about this at all. 
I promise you she ain't happy about this at all or else she wouldn't be out here making this daggone video calling y'all names because that's all they ever have is name calling like children like I always saying people who are absolutely act and sound like children but y'all make sure you go ahead and like this daggone video subscribe if you are new make sure you comment i see you all in the next one if you're doing it stop it get some help